to make kimchi. Today, I'll show you how to make authentic kimchi. This homemade kimchi is incredibly delicious and easy to make. Simply follow the step-by-step -step instructions and you'll make the best kimchi you've ever had. All you need is Napa cabbage, spring onion, ginger, garlic, onion, chili flakes, fish sauce, and salt. To start, take your Napa cabbage and dice it using a sharp knife. Transfer to a large bowl. Fill with water. Now you need to add salt. Mix it thoroughly together. Cover with a plate for 60 minutes. Drain and rinse. Now it's time to add the spring onion. Then add the onion. Then add the ginger. Then add the garlic. Then add the chili flakes. Then add the fish sauce. Then add the eggs. 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 Mix thoroughly. It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Ensure the lid is completely closed. Place the jar in the fridge for 20 It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Place the jar in the fridge for 20 It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Place the jar in the fridge for 20 It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Place the jar in it's time to transfer the mixture Place into the jar a jar. In it's time to transfer the mixture Place the jar into a in jar. It's time to transfer the mixture Place into the a jar, jar in the fridge for Put on gloves. It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Place the jar in the fridge for 20 It's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Place the jar in the fridge for 24 it's time to transfer the mixture into a jar. Leave the jar where it is for 24 hours. After 24 hours, the vegetables have fermented, creating a delicious batch of homemade kimchi. This is by far the best homemade kimchi you will ever try. Look how good it turned out! It looks absolutely delicious, and it only took a few minutes to make. Enjoy! <laughs>
American cheese. Onion. Ketchup. 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 Mustard. Mustard. Sauce. 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 Pepper. Pepper. Pickles. Filet fish. Mix thoroughly. Egg. Mix with your hands. Place cheeseburger mixture into your shoes. Put on the shoes. Walk around for approximately five minutes. Take off the shoes. Scoop out one handful out of each shoe and place it onto the bottom burger bun. Place down that top bun. Perfect! Look how delicious this looks. It looks identical to a McDonald's cheeseburger. <laughs> Yummy, I cannot wait to tuck into this. Enjoy! <laughs> How to make katsu curry. From making the curry mixture to preparing the Japanese chicken schnitzel, everything will be thoroughly covered in this recipe video. You'll need Japanese curry mix, jasmine rice, plain flour, eggs, carrots, potatoes, onion, panko breadcrumbs, vegetable oil, and a whole chicken. Start by peeling and chopping two carrots. Then peel and chop four potatoes. And finally, dice one onion. Place a large pot over medium heat. Vegetable oil. Add the onions. Saute onion pieces until they start to turn translucent. Add the carrot. Add potato. Stir thoroughly. Add water and bring to boil for five minutes. While that's boiling, it's time to cook the rice. For each cup of jasmine rice, add one and a half cups of water. Leave that to cook. Stir. Add Japanese curry mix. Thoroughly mix together. While that's simmering, it's time to prepare the chicken. Using a knife, carefully remove it. Using a meat tenderizer, carefully flatten the chicken thigh filet. Using a meat tenderizer, carefully flatten the chicken thigh filet. Perfect! For this next step, you'll need egg wash, plain flour, and panko breadcrumbs. Place the chicken into the egg wash, then into the plain flour, then back into the egg wash. Then coat in panko breadcrumbs. Add vegetable oil to your deep fryer. Slowly place the coated chicken thigh filet into the deep fryer. Deep fry for 10 minutes until golden brown. Carefully remove from deep fryer. In a bowl, add your cooked rice, Japanese chicken cutlet, and your Japanese curry mixture. Serve and enjoy. You're gonna need more rice than that. Perfect. Perfect. Enjoy. 